I just got my Raspberry Pi 2 in and uh, I'm excited to put an operating system on it and I'm going to show you how to do that here today as well as show you how to get XBMC known as Kodi, the newest version and uh, I'm going to be using uh, it used to be Raz B M C, but now it is called OS M C. And you go to osmc.tv is where we will start, and we will go over to downloads to start the download of the program to make the, the startup disk, the mini SD card, and uh, then after we set up that disk, we will place it in. The Raspberry 2 and then after we place it in there it will start up XBMC Cody and uh, when it does I will show you how you can overclock it uh, right in the program built into uh, XBMC Cody and uh, that's an exciting thing to do I'll see you on the other side you go to the top of the link you go to download you know what I'm saying mate do you pick the download page governor it brings you to this page what system are you using right now a linux an apple or a windows system i'm using a windows so i will click that and you will click the download self-extracting installer here piece of cake after you you put another shrimp on the bob eh after you install it it will look like this install it to your Desktop. This is the screen that will pop up. Select your language. English. Would you like to install? Yeah. For the Raspberry 2. Excelente. What version would you like? Oh, the only one available. Sounds great. Oh. I want it on the SD card. Configure it. Wired connection. Don't have wireless yet. Oh. There is my mini SD card. I will click it, then click next. I accept the license agreement, even though I've never read it. Mate, do you want to read time over the English? Yes, I do. Now I wait. I am so posh. It is done. You sure you want to install the device you've selected? Absolutely. Bing. Installed to the device. Hey, governor. Congratulations, you are done. Close it out. I safely remove the micro mini SD. I place it into my Raspberry Pi. Now, after plugging in the Raspberry Pi, it brings me into an install page installing the files from the OSMC. XBMC is now loaded. If you notice there was updates, it's already updating this the file system. It is on a weak um, skin which we can change but um, XBMC is now installed. Now it's fun part begins getting everything to work properly. As I've opened up Cody here. I go under programs. I go under OSMC settings. Oh, what is this? Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Interesting. If I want to click this over here, I can overclock my Raspberry. Hi. Interesting. I don't know what this stuff means. Maybe I should just push mm, medium. 
the fun. Apply. I have now been overclocked. I am a genius. Ricola. You watched me from the beginning. This is XBMC, which is also used to be Raz BMC, which is now changed to OS MC. So confusing as all get out. But I do like the way that it works. It functions really well on my Raspberry Pi 2, as well as it has settings to be able to overclock it and be able to mess with it um, pretty heavily. And I've got to install all the other programs that I like on there. Might be another video, but um, hope you enjoyed the video. Like, rate, subscribe, and uh, talk to you later, Governor.